Uh, this was a new cylinder and I went ahead and I put it on the new cylinder so it would stop corrosion. Also, uh, even though these had some corrosion on them, I did several of these cylinders. If you rub here, you can feel it, feel it right here. And how long have you had it on the, the corrosion? This has been uh, on there over a year now. You said over a year now? Over a year, yeah. And you can feel it. If you, if you rub your hand on here, you can feel where I've done it. Mm -hmm. Feel it? So it stopped what corrosion was there, and it made it really look good. I did these, uh, the brass, and I did the gray uh, a year ago uh, when I did the annual on the aircraft. All the tubes I did, uh, coated all the tubes. This I did not coat, and you can see how it's starting to tarnish up. Everything I coated stayed nice and shiny. <clears throat> and you don't see any corrosion on the fins either. If I were to build up a motor, I would coat every part with it and not have to deal with it anymore. Yeah, you can see where the transition here, because the pigment was already dead. And you can see, again, I did a wipe on on this here. So, so no issues with the bugs again. And we can see you right here that, oh, we're not coated, we're not coated, we're not coated. Right here is the exactly. line where the coating is starting. Exactly. And you can even feel it. And I defy anybody to tell where I did that. And same on the, on the uh, horizontal back there. Here, and I want you to rub here. Now yeah. do the same thing up front. Five, you can see it on the can you, can you yeah, feel it? Yeah, right away. I mean, this one, you like green, this one, you like stuff. Okay, green. now I dare you to find any, now I did a wipe on with this, and I did it fairly quick. See how perfect it is? Absolutely perfect. And I purposely didn't do it back here. And you can see the, the, the dry water here, but, but not exactly. there. Exactly, exactly. Good. See, Frank, the, can you see the water spot here? So that's the surface that's not been treated with ceramic. And then if you look here in the forward section, the, the water won't, looks like the water won't dry on it, it would just, I guess, fall off. So this section back here has not been coated? No, it's and not. And you can see the water? And you can see the, the water spot. We were flying this yesterday. We probably did eight or ten landings yesterday on this alone. Hey, that thing is a piece of art. It's incredible. What's that? Oh, this? It's yeah, it's a brand new airplane. Brand oh, new production. Oh. This is a uh, oh, carbon cup. Uh, this is a brand new airplane. It's only got 60 hours on it. But here, I want uh, I want you to come up here and feel it. Stand up right here. <clears throat> oh, it is exactly here. Exactly. Yeah, you can feel right away the transition. Looks yeah. like if the surface is slickier and sealed compared exactly. to the back. Now I did a wipe on on this. You cannot see the transition, whereas if there was any overspray. Now, we were flying this all day yesterday. See all the bugs we got yep. all over? Yep. Touch, touch some of the bugs. Whoop. Here we go. And that's just one light coat on there. So you basically take the bug off, the bug off without right. even, I mean, right. I'm not applying any pressure here. I'm just basically Right. Wiping. Now what happens is if these bugs, because of the acidity in the bugs, if they were on a normal thing like the Stearman, they eat into the paint. Yes. And once they're into, like love bugs here in Florida, the acidity from them will eat into the paint. Nothing gets through this. So these bugs I can leave on here for a month and just take and wipe them right off. Feel that? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, right away. Yeah, right away. I mean, it, it just, it just, you slip right. Through. There's no surface tension. No surface tension, yes. Uh, now I took, I took some of it and I did it on the leading. This takes a tremendous, tremendous amount of abuse because of water spray. Water spray is so hard on a prop you can't believe it. I coated the uh, nickel leading edge of the prop. Look at the bug. Oh. So you come right up. It's even held up on the prop leading edge, which takes a tremendous, you cannot believe how it eats a prop away with water spray on it. 